Well boys and girls, you're joining me on my way home from work and uh, it's very windy today. Anyway, this video is a sort of a confessional. I didn't think I'd be doing this so quickly but I advertised my bike for sale. Oh, I know a lot of you uh, MTOF 7 people will be surprised by that. Uh, owned the bike for just a year now and uh, as much as I love this bike I never I always thought it wasn't gonna be you know like for forever and I was hoping to get a um, an MTO 9 or an XSR 900 anyway and then I started getting swayed by other bikes like like the Duke 790 and stuff like that but just recently I've Obviously I bought that CBR 600 project bike and uh, I've kind of, I haven't like over budget, I haven't like made myself broke because of it but I've bought a lot of parts you know like maintenance parts, chain sprocket, tyres, air filter plugs, brand new fairing, uh, what else did I buy, uh, rear sets. Uh, I've just bought so much stuff and I spent so much time sort of planning the things I'm going to do and trying to find time to fit parts and stuff that I sort of just started to think like I don't, I don't really need two bikes do I? Once the uh, CBR's all done up and, and looking pretty I'll, I'll be super happy to ride around on that so yeah I decided like screw it I'll just stick the uh, MT on the auctions and see what happens so I put it on the auctions yesterday today's Sunday so it's, it's got a week left it might not sell to be honest I mean the price is not unreasonable but I, you know it's, it's turning into winter so selling the bike at this time of year, it's almost like the, the it's the beginning of the, the bad times obviously now it is it's 23 degrees outside now at 7 o'clock at night so it's still not cold or anything and it's in the daytime it was still 30 degrees today so it's real good riding weather it's just whether people will want to buy a bike when the you know the season's about to turn into autumn winter but well, I mean I bought this in November the middle of November so it doesn't bother me but I don't know the Japanese are a bit more sensible about things like that but um, yeah I've advertised it and the plan is uh, basically as long if it sells then I'm just going to spend another month or so fixing up the CBR but I will hurry up the inspection part so I can get plate get number plates get insurance and all that and I'll just do things a bit slower so I can ride the bike every I'll just make it so I can ride the bike you know let's just like to work and stuff not not like go mad in the mountains and stuff on track days but as long as I can ride it to and from work then it's okay you know like if it's unpainted the panels are unpainted or whatever it doesn't matter but just as long as it's rideable and legal so I'll do that first and then I'll start thinking about all the uh, the tuning stuff but if for example I get a good price for this MT-07 I got to pay off the loan but if I got a bit of money left over I'd be kind of interested in buying um, an off-road bike or you know like a second bike so maybe going back to a KTM again but not, not a new one something a bit older like an old 690 Duke or uh, a 990 Supermoto or something like that I totally haven't decided like I spend every night I've spent every night this week looking at bike auctions and like catalogues and thinking oh I want one of those oh I want one of those too so I've got no idea what I want really but I think this old my trusty old MT-07 is going to go to a new owner soon so pretty sad but you know life has changed <laughs> yeah get out of the way fool so um, guys tell me what you think about that I'm sure some of you are going to think it's a real bad idea what are you doing man it's the best bike in the world and uh, you know you're not wrong I have totally loved this bike 
and I haven't outgrown it at all it's not like oh it's Sony 700 I need a 900 I need a litre bike now it's nothing like that I still haven't got to this bike's limits it's literally just had it for a year want a change hard to explain really but uh, yeah so guys that's it for today's video last wheelie of the day and I'll see you in the next video so please give me a like share subscribe etc etc thanks for watching goodbye